So you're just opening up Snagit 2022 and you notice that there is no place for you to restore your backup .snag archive file like there was in previous versions of Snagit. So you're probably wondering how we can do that. Well, we can't. We can't get that into Snagit 2022. So what we'll need to do is we'll need to get an older version of Snagit and import that backup file into the older version. I recommend just downloading Snagit 2021 and then either using your 2022 key, which will work for that, or you can just use Snagit 2021 as a free trial. Once you've done that, um, you're gonna go ahead and open up Snagit 2021 and you'll see a screen like the one that I have here. I've gone ahead and opened up both the Snagit editor and the Snagit capture window here just to show you both of them open because we're gonna need to close both of them. So I wanted them both open. So once you have this open, you're gonna go ahead and go to edit, editor preferences, library, and then you're going to click restore backup. Mine's just here on my desktop. I'm just gonna go ahead and double click this backup file. We're gonna click restore and replace. Once that's done, the next thing we need to do is close out of Snagit 2021. And you can't just click the X's, not for both of them anyways. You can close the X on the editor, but for the capture window, we actually need to go to file and then exit text in the Snagit there. That completely closes Snagit. It would show up here in the hidden icons tray if it wasn't closed. Our last step is going to be to open Snagit 2022. If the capture window is the only thing that opens, we can go ahead and click on open editor here. And if we're not in the library already, go ahead and click library in the top left here to get there. And you should see this prompt saying, don't worry, all your captures are safe with this blue button that says convert captures now. What that button does is it takes all library captures from previous versions that are showing in another library and it will convert them into 2022, which is exactly what we want to happen since our captures are in 2021. So we click this button and we are good to go.